Early morning in Monterrey, Mexico, and commuters are on their way to work. Things are a bit different these days. Face masks are obligatory, stations are equipped with temperature checks, and the bus they ride is powered by natural gas. Julio Rivera has been driving this route for a decade and says these vehicles are lighter and use less fuel. They are part of a regional initiative for public transportation to decrease dependence on fossil fuels. This project has 80 buses operating, all new, modern units which run on compressed natural gas, which have allowed us to fulfill our promises when it comes to sustainability. The buses are made by a Chinese company, Shongtong Bus, and now run eight different routes through the city's industrial districts. While these first natural gas-powered models were imported from China, the next generation will be made here in Mexico. It's the result of an alliance between two bus companies, one Mexican, one Chinese, that are constructing a manufacturing plant here in the region with the capacity to produce nearly 5,000 vehicles a year for the North American market. The project is just one example of an increasing investment trend in Mexico, which sees Chinese companies creating strategic alliances with their Mexican counterparts. The new fleet is also representing savings for the city. These buses are also profitable. While the diesel bus previously used up 44% of its total earnings in fuel, its gas equivalent uses less than 30%. So as well as helping the environment, it also gives us more income. We're showing that sustainability is not only possible, but that it makes more economic sense. As well as good business, it's good environmental policy, a problem Antonio Hernandez, a local green activist and biologist, knows all too well. We need these sort of projects because when you speak with health professionals, they are very aware of the problem that thousands of deaths occur every year due to air pollution, a lot of which are linked directly to public transport. So this is one part of public policy that needs close attention. With the fleet of gas-powered buses here set to double locally next year and the offer of Chinese technology to increase across the nation, local officials hope their example will be the one that boosts sales. Alastair Bavastock, CGTN, Monterrey, Mexico.